Come on over, it's time for Tim Friend. All right, welcome back to Tim Friend. Timberly and Catherine just attained a sport level C. We gotta go through the rest of the week. Uh, I think a student's gonna ask me a question at some point. Oh, oh no, because that happened uh, that happened last week. Yes, let's get them in well of support. Hell yes. I, uh, uh, who, oh, settle down and stop with the knocking. I'll be there in two shakes. Uh, you were sleeping. I got you. Oh dear. Professor, is that you? I, just a moment. What should I do? I can't open the door in this state. Manuela, you simply must quit. Oversleeping. Hold on. Where are my clothes? I can't even find my... Where in blazes is my underwear? Man, she was partying. Now oh, I... What is my dressing robe belt caught on? I can't tie this properly. It's not even covering... Oh, Manuela. This will have to do. Are you okay in there? I'm fine. Just just hold on a moment. Damn, Manuela. What's she going to show up in? Her normal clothes. Ah, hello. Sorry to have kept you waiting. So, what do you want? Uh, what were you doing in there? I couldn't hear you or anything. Excuse me? You had a reason for coming here, I assume? I put a lot of time and effort into making it possible to talk with you, you know. Sorry. You goof. No, you've done nothing wrong. Let's just say I'm not having a good day. Actually, I didn't have a good night. <sighs> Never mind. What did you want, anyway? Uh, I have a message from a knight, apparently? You heard from him? The fellow from last night? Huh. What did he have to say? He said, we will never go out together again. You know, a cool thing to say. Yeah, figures. Kind of saw it coming, actually. That's why I came back to my room and went to bed. To get over it. Yeah, to bed. Thank you for checking in on me. Was that all you wanted? Well then, good night. Sleep well, I guess. Even though you were just asleep. Ah, oh, Manuela. She's got a complicated love life herself, just like Sylwain. But, uh, rather, rather more different times. Blah, 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 they got the perfect horse. Great. Alright, to do's at Punch B+. Hmm, 353 till A. I don't know if we're going to be able to get him up to A in time. Ah, well. We'll try our best. A reason E plus for Manuela. I'll take what we can get. Just like uh, D, all of E plus, all of D, all of D plus, all of C. No, not all of C. Just fuck. I don't remember. Several ranks to go. Yeah, let's get this always support out of the way. Hello, Professor. You're really on the move today. A lot to get done, I take it. I'm happy to help. Tell me, is there anything I can do to lighten your load a bit? Uh, I appreciate the offer, but leave me alone. I'm not trying to support with you. Ah, oh, surely there must be something. Don't be shy about asking for help. We're practically siblings, after all. Cut from the same cloth. I was raised by Gerald, just as you were. So we should have no trouble getting along. You were raised by Gerald? Huh, did I not mention that? How thoughtless. What an embarrassing gaffe. My parents died when I was small and I came to live in the monastery. It was an aimless existence. But sometimes, a knight would pass by wearing magnificent armor. That knight was Geralt. And the first time he laid eyes on me, he made me his squire. What was he thinking, eh? Uh, it sounds like Geralt. He's kind of a... goofus. No kidding. I don't think I'll ever fully understand his logic. Later, I heard that the squire preceding me had died of a terrible plague. Jesus, everything you tell me about is linked with tragedy. Your parents' death, the squire preceding you dying of terrible plague. What's your deal, Eloise? Maybe one day I'll care enough to find out. I looked a bit like him and was about the same age, so Gerald thought me a suitable replacement. Not a great uh, interview process, but whatever. Little nutty old Gerald, there's no doubt about that. Quite a character. All that was more than 30 years ago. How time flies. 30 years? Jesus Christ, how old am I? That's right, I wasn't even 15 years old. Well, Gerald hardly seems to have aged since then. In fact, over drinks he once told me... Uh, perhaps that's a story for another day. At any rate, that's Gerald for you. One of a kind. I don't think there's anyone else quite like him. Yeah, probably not. He's one of a kind, indeed. Uh, right, well, now you've heard my whole story. I hope that you understand why now why I feel such a strong sense of attachment to you. If you're ever in a bind, just give me a holler. 
I'll help however I can. Thanks for offering, but I can handle myself. <sighs> indeed, indeed. Well, I'll let you get back to it. But truly, if I can take anything off your plate, don't hesitate to let me know. Okay, Eloise. Maybe I, maybe I fucking should support with him in one of these playthroughs, just so I can learn about Geralt. Will, will he tell me about my dad? I don't know. This, my dad is such like a, such a mysterious presence in my life. Like I just, I just don't know. Oil and water. What the fuck is oil and water? Jimbus Krimbus. Uh. Well, I think everyone's pretty low on motivation. We got one, two, three, four. We we're able to do one, two, three, four, five, six training sessions. So yeah, let's uh, let's do another exploration day. Uh, we're just gonna roll straight into the. Oop, go to the greenhouse first. Oh, I forgot to pick up the something off the ground for Seta, didn't I? That's why there is that glowy spot on the minimap that I saw just ever so briefly. Yeah, it's over here. It's right by the greenhouse anyway, so it's not that big a deal. Right? Yeah, there it is. You motherfucker. All right, gotta give that back. What's up? Greenhouse keeper. Speed carrots? No? All right. Well, rude, but whatever. Uh, no more pale blue flower seeds. So we gotta buy more of that shit. Cause we want those poop, those blue bale flower flower glebes, uh, so that we can try to get more fucking speed carrots. Peach currant, great. Uh, to you, right? You does you have them? Oh no, but I should buy all the bait before I forget. Gotta buy that bait for the fistfuls of fish event that's coming up in. I gotta fucking fish like crazy there. Uh, it must be Southern Merchant then. Yeah, you got the seeds. Excuse me. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go. That'll hold me down for quite a while. Greenhouse. And then we'll go to Seteth and turn in that quest. Then we'll go to the dining hall. <coughs> Excuse me. Plant. Pale blue flower seeds times four. Plant them. Great. Go to here. Talk to Seteth. I've been playing a, a game called... I have i don't know if I've actually brought it up in this playthrough. I've surely brought it up in others. Oh, I, shit. Have I brought it up in this playthrough? Uh, a game called Trails of Cold Steel. Uh, Legend of Heroes, colon, Trails of Cold Steel. It's a JRPG uh, with some similar concepts. You're not a professor, but it's definitely based on a school zone, uh, you're a student instead. And the controls are just different enough. Uh, in particular, it's got a, uh, a turbo mode where it just literally speeds up the entire fucking game, uh, which is great. Like, I can't lie. I love that aspect of it. I love that gameplay, that gameplay feature. Ooh, Ash and Annette, even though Annette did not get drained of motivation, that's fine. You want to get them the supports anyway, right? Yes. Great. Get that motivation. Delicious. Uh, today's special. Like, we just don't have anyone we care about in here. Uh, so we gotta feed them real food. Real, real boy food. Unless we do, like, a, like a this. Let's do a this. Let's see what happens. Anyway, I, I keep almost... Because, like, in, in Legend of Heroes, colon, Trails of Cold Steel, you can run with B, but you can also run and turbo mode at the same time. So I keep almost instinctively pressing, like, the turbo mode button just so I can fucking blast through these places. Uh, Mercedes and Lorenz. Mercedes and Lorenz. Gotta get the support points even though they won't need it because he'll be an adjutant at all, like, all the time. But we gotta get our motivation up. Who... Is that everyone? Just, just to do? Well, let's get to do. Let's get to do. Where am, where am he? To do, Leonie. Cause we might as well crank that shit, buddy. Get that motivation. Gotta get that brawler A so we can make him a, a very strong punch boy. Uh, all right. Now that we've done that, we can just spend the rest of our time. Let's do choir practice. So we can get a little more professor experience and faith experience on particular people. Uh, which would be probably Manuela and Annette, I guess. Because Mercedes is likely to get her faith up to up to A before 20. 
at 420. Little goof, a little haha -ha moment. Uh, is there a note for us in the advice box? There's one note. Uh, whenever I go for a walk, I get a strange feeling that someone is watching me. Who could it be? Uh, it's your overprotective big brother. I know this, because you're flaying. No, she didn't like that. Dang it. All right. Ooh, who do I get a support point with this time? To do. That's fine. I don't super care, but whatever. Uh, let's get some training in. Let's use Rhea uh, Manuela for swords as well, because we might as well use her, because support points with her vaguely do matter. Let's see. Rhea. Faculty training. Swords, please. And Manuel is in the greenhouse. What's my activity points at? I don't remember. I'll have to pay attention to that when I'm getting the fucking faculty training. I think this is my last one. Yep. All right. Faculty training. Swords. Good. Take what I can get. B rank swords. Brank. All right. Uh, inventory. Let's check out our abilities. Because now... Now I have Axe Breaker. I can get rid of the Reason Rank one. And might as well... No, we won't use Battalion Vantage. Vantage for Dimitri, though. Very importante. Put that on Defensive Tactics. You you skunk. What? That's nothing. I will put Lance Breaker on to do instead of Lance Prowess, because that's laughable. Uh, Felix is fine. Ash is fine. Sylvain's obviously fine. Mercedes needs Fiendish Blow instead of... Uh... Authority. She doesn't need authority that much. Uh, Ingrid, you're fine. Lorenz, everyone else is fine. All right, cool. And how about battalions? Everyone's got... She's got sacred monks? Is her authority only E? That's, that's a bummer. I want her authority to be higher than that. Yeah, it's only E. What's she got? She's got the Sarah sacred monks? That's fine. Uh, he doesn't need a battalion. We are going to have to refresh these before we go into the next one. Cool. Combat arts. Who's got cool combat arts? Uh, you're... F Ooh, let's do Bane of Monsters instead of Grounder. Uh, you're fine. You got Vantage. Do, are we gonna make you a, a Cavalier? No, he's, he's just gonna stay a Mercenary, I think, for a while. Just so we can get the fucking, um... Just so we can get more speed. Uh, Dudu, you're not... Are you using axes very much? I don't think so. What's rushing blow? Fading blow? Wow, that's... I mean... Oh, it's it's like plus seven because the punch weapons are weak as shit. Uh, Ash, no. Sylvain, no. No, no, no. No. Alright. So everything's fine. Alright. Let's book it out of here. End that free time. Let's go teach our kids what to do in case of emergency. It's to do because we got that support with to do. Gotta get him up to A. We're gonna use Manuela as well. We just gotta pump that that reason experience into her as much as we can. All right, that was about fifth. That was 54 experience for him. Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna get him up to A by the time he is 20, but we will, as always, try our best. It's just so hard to not murder things with to do because he hits like a truck, truck, truck. All right, did Manuela, uh, let's do Ash for flying. And then we'll do our horse people for their uh, horse riding. Very good, B rank flying. Now it's less necessary, because I think, actually I think he only needs like rank C to become a wyvern rider anyway. Is that right? I don't remember. Uh, Ingrid and Sylvain, we just want them to be at horse A plus as fast as possible so they get that sick, sick movement plus. I forgot to give them flowers! I wanted to do that. Dang! What a goober. What a goober I've made of myself. I wanted to give Sylvain and Ingrid a flower each to bump up their motivation to maximum, and I didn't, and I'm sorry. Uh, then let's do Annette so they can get support points with each other next time. We'll just put in the faith points with Annette. I don't know if we're gonna... If, if we're going to make it there, comma, we can make it anywhere, but we'll try our best. Uh, and there being Faith A. Though, I guess she just she doesn't really have the Faith shit that we want for her to be a bishop anyway, do we? Might as well just be a, be a, a what is it, a warlock? Yeah, warlock. Oop. To do, hell yeah, let's get that free motivation. 
Ugh. Uh, here you are again. I came to check on the flowers. I see. Cool. Good conversation. Yep. The flowers you helped water are in bloom now. Have a look. Aren't they lovely? Oh. Indeed. My sister was fond of this one in particular. This gigantic flower next to me. It's a Pokemon. Where... I didn't know you had a sister. It never came up. Dusker is a dead land. Its flowers were all trampled under the boots of soldiers. But seeing this blossom brings back memories. Ugh. <laughs> that was so weak. I'm sorry for that grunt. I do not know why I'm telling you all of this. Uh, you're... You are unusually talkative today. Something wrong? It surprises me as well. Or something... So right. But if you are from Fodlan, you must know what became of the people of Dusker. The people who betrayed their allies from Fargus. The ones who were punished for regicide. The Dusker are shunned for their crimes, even now. It would be in your interest not to spend any more time with me than necessary. Uh, I'll spend my time however I like. You can't tell me what to do. You may think little of it now, but your reputation will eventually suffer. But, to be completely candid, it pleases me to be able to speak with you like this. If you truly do not mind, I would be glad to receive more visits from you in the future. Oh, that's sweet, though. I can see why that'd be romantic. There's someone I follow on Twitter who's definitely a big uh, Dadu byleth shipper, and I'm like, all right, I'm fine with it. Dadu is... He's very sad. He's hes not my favorite character, but he's definitely not my least favorite character. What a weird pair. Dudu and Lawrence? Whatever, though. Free professor experience. And then the horse training. You get the perfect. Very good. Screaming towards horse A+, with Ingrid. I love it. Everyone creeps up. Let's see. How close are we now? 271. Alright, so that was like... It's 28 experience? Marianne's birthday. Let's not do anything for it. All right, now we can do a paralo paralogu. Because we got a lot of them to do. Yeah, get it? To do. Look at all this shit we got to do. True Chivalry's Felix is one. Remember Nuptials is this one that I've done a gillion times. Uh, Oil and Water's Hanneman Manuela. Uh, bah, dwarf. Let's do... Let's do Tales of the Red King. I do like this paralogue. It's tough. It's a tougher one, but I do like it. It's got a it's got an interesting sort of setup to it. Which makes it challenging. And I I like challenging levels. It it also doesn't waste a lot of space. Hmm, what was that name again? What's on your mind? Oh, this is frustrating me to no end. I simply can't recall. Oh, I have it. Xanado. Xanado the Red Canyon? That's it. It was not long ago that we were there. And still, I somehow managed to forget. What about it? Well, that place brought back some fragments of my memory. I cannot help but wonder why. I feel we must return to find some answers there. Uh, let's go. Yeah, fuck it. Yes, you are right. Let me whip around this ribbon on my arm. <laughs> For as the saying goes, there is no time like the present. And also the past, which we can revert to whenever we want to. It's most unlike our professor to go wandering alone like that. Curious, Your Highness? Yes, I have an uneasy feeling about this. Let's gather the others and find out what's going on. Oh, I got loyal students. Yes, it's all coming back to me. This structure. Oh, but it's as though my memories are clouded. The most important pieces are obscured. But I once called this home. I have no doubt. I seem to recall something on the other side of that wall. I can't see it, but I can still feel it. It is not my imagination. I know this to be true. We are already deep in this valley. Oh, what was that awful sound? Uh, it was a terrible scream. Yes, and that was not a beast, but a huge and terrifying one. Look, there, at the entrance of the valley, a giant shadow. I wonder if it could be a monster beast. Eh? Okay, we just gotta gotta do a loading, that's fine. Oh, I forgot to do the, the tournament. Well, whatever. Who gives a dunk? Not me, I'm not 
I'm not mad that I missed it. It's fine. Nah, it's not that big a deal. Steel Gauntlets Plus is, I mean, I'm sure it would be fine. But I don't necessarily want to waste time on it. Alright, so this is Tales of the Red Canyon. It's a paralogue that starts out with just you, uh, surrounded by three uh, de demon beasts, giant wolves, and then your students spawn up here, uh, flanking them, but they are in turn flanked by yet more giant beasts. Three birds, and like a, what is it, like an armadillo thing? Just a wild demonic beast. Cool. I like that there's demonic beasts, and then there's just like, it was just like a big bird. It's pretty wild. And then I once we defeat, I think it's all the birds. Once we defeat all the wolves, then the birds will start coming towards us. And then once we defeat all the birds, then reinforcements will appear, and the armadillo is going to start heading for us. So it's going to be kind of a pain in the ass. Uh, let's go to the marketplace, battalion guild, replenish all of our people. Thank God it's so cheap to do that. But if it's so cheap, why make it cost anything at all? I don't understand. Annette has Thyrsus. Let's... Okay. Armory. Yes. We gotta see if everyone's got good enough weapons. Looks like I need another iron sword. Uh, Demetrius needs another iron lance. Sylvain's fine. Dedu is fine. Obviously, Mercedes and Annette are fine. Ash is fine. Ingrid, we could reforge that training lance. Felix is fine. Lawrence, don't care. Flame, don't care. Manuela... Ooh, we gotta, gotta change that shit out, don't we? Uh, whoops, units. Yes. No, Lorenz. Yes, Manuela. Lorenz will adjutant onto Mercedes. And Flane will adjutant onto me. Inventory. Items. Me. Items. Uh, let's dump this iron sword from the inventory onto me. And do we have a lance for Demetrius? We do. Thanks, Lorenz. Give it to me. Gimme. Cool. I think we are good to go. Let's check the map. Uh, there's not really a real point in running people around at this flanking side, except to get this chest. Because you may remember, this is the same map that we fought the bandits on that one time, where we had, like, the flank Zor approach and, uh, what's-his-face with their celebrity whose name I make fun of. Uh, let's give... Well, let's let's throw this fucking thing in there. Anyone else got garbage on them? You do. You do. You definitely do. Ooh, we gotta give the fucking stat boosters that we got from Sylvain's thing jam. Gotta give those to people. Uh, Manuela. You have Nosferatu, that's fine. Who's... Okay, what stat boosters do we have? Got an energy drop, so strength, speed, resistance, defense, resistance. Alright, who needs strength? Who's a strength person? Not you! Definitely not those two. Uh, Mercedes doesn't care, and that doesn't care. Ash could use strength. He's 17. Wow, Ingrid, never mind. It's Ingrid. Holy shit. She's got less strength than fucking Manuela. God damn, Ingrid. Have this energy drop. Just, just drink it. Drink all of it. Eat. Eat the whole thing. God, it's 12 strength. Miserable. All right, speed. 17, 18, 15. Okay, well, yeah, the dude's always going to be bad at speed. Mercedes and Annette. Ugh. Felix? All right, it's going to be Felix because he's, he's carrying heavier shit anyway. Uh, let's dump. Well, let's just fucking trade it for the vulnerary for now. Uh, speed wing. Trade. Get rid of that vulnerary. Items. I wish this was less cumbersome. I wish you could have, like, a person selected and then use items from the convoy on them. Uh, then defense and resistance? Yeah. Uh, you're... You could use better. You could do better. You could do better. Everyone needs that resistance, though. Pretty much everyone. Wow. It's so wild that Ash's resistance is weirdly high. Ooh. Let's give... Oh, my God. They're so miserable at resistance. Let's... I kind of want to give Felix the resistance one. Just because he might end up fighting mages a lot. But... I don't know. I don't know. Let's... Let's give Ash the defense ones. Because he's, he's ostensibly a melee friend. Ones. The defense one. Use it. Use it. And we'll give... 
Demetrius the magic ones. So let's let's put some shit away for now, Demetrius. It's just for now. It's gonna be okay. And get in there. Use and use. Use it. Why is the default no? Yes. Do it. Now get that fucking get that fucking music, etc., etc. What did we put in here? Killer lance. I think we put a killer lance in there. Yeah, there it is. And let's take the short spear. Fuck it. All right. Map. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Inventory. Gotta give Ingrid or Sylvain a chest key. Let's give it to Sylvain, because Ingrid needs the experience more. Take that. And then we can have him just run over and get that fucking chest while everyone else plays the game. Who's got the high XP? Everyone's at 15 or 16. Ooh, Demetrius and Mercedes are very high. Let's bring people around. Annette's fine in the back. Felix is fine in the back. Uh, Sil Silwingrid is fine in the back. All right. Let's get down to business and defeat these Huns. Whoop, whoop. No, do not save over that. Cannot save over that. That's my maddening playthrough. Do not want to delete that data. Grog. Oh, that's my face. Sorry. What's this now? Or, sorry. What is it now? Oh, they weren't there before. We're surprised by this, I guess. They're all roaring in the same way. Those hungry wolves. That howl must have riled them up. We have no choice but to fight our way out. Give it your all. And then these guys show up, conveniently equipped and re-equipped with the shit that I want them to have. Oh no, but now they're trapped. This is bad. It's a good thing we managed to catch up with our professor. Wolves at the front, hawks at the rear, and at the canyon mouth, a demonic beast. Perhaps to call it a stray beast would be most fitting. If we cannot take out the beast, I doubt we will ever see the monastery again. All right. We must help our professor, first and foremost. This is a touch tough situation for anyone. You got it. The wolves are all going to rush at me, so I really got to really gotta start wangling them away as soon as I can. Uh, let's use... Who's, who's got stuff? Who's got the, the shield breakies? Let's use... I can use Mercedes to break one of the shields, but I kind of want to use Mercedes to break a health bar. He's only got two health bars, but... Uh, what's this thing? Oh, he's got a void with combat that's two squares away or whatever as long as he's got his shields up. So I'm, I'm going to use Onslaught. No. He's got good charm. Wow, Dimitri has amazing charm. I always forget. Uh, he's got Assault Troop. Roll through him with Assault Troop. Hell yeah. I thought charm would help me get the fucking the thing jam up. Yeah, it's it's like accuracy of, of, of thing jams. It's, it's the accuracy of Thing James. Raises the hit rate of Gambits. Oh, maybe uh, Assault Troops just has a lower base accuracy. Yeah, it's only 50, whereas... Fucking, where's Dudu? There's Dudu. Uh, Dudu's... Dudu's base 52. What the fr fr friggity fuck? Maybe there's like a max on it? I don't know. Alright, then we'll use Dudu. Gambito. Gambito on slot. We can break the shields without having to shoot from far away, which would reduce our accuracy by 30%. Hey, Dudu gets speed and strength and defense. A perfect level for Dudu. All right, get that Woot Steel. We can use Manuela to... to uh, oh, God damn it, Dudu. God damn Dudu, you. God damn Dudu. He pushed it away with that gambit. I didn't even think about that fudge. All right. Well, we'll just uh, we'll just move everyone forward then, because we broke the shield, so it's gonna be weaker anyway. Uh, we can just delete him, or delete a health bar with Annette. Might as well just to get the experience. I uh, get dexterity and resistance. What an incredible level! Thanks, Annette. Uh, Felix, Felix Navidad can shoot away at this wolf with a miss because he's very far away uh, Ingrid can roll up uh, oh it looks like my phone is on the floor I heard a mysterious vibration from the my feet zone and uh, turns out all the important texts I may have been missing uh, I've been really really fucking missing use Sylvain to go around here 
Uh, thank you again to Gregory for telling me that Cavaliers get plus two speed when they're dismounted. I did not know that. That's not, to me, that's not as exciting as having like the, uh, the, Im the resistance, not resistance, the removal of the arrow weakness and the ability to gain defensive terrain bonuses, but that's still valid. And in Maddening, that's probably going to be real important for me. Uh, let's wait with Timberly, and then next time on Tim Friend, uh, we will wrap up this paralogue, probably. Maybe. Hopefully. All right. Bye, everybody. <laughs> with Tim Friend.